Guys, for cheap and reliable coins, check out MuleFactory.com and use the code OWENFIFA at checkout for a discount. You can see, guys, they have loads of different coins up. Obviously, the prices will change as the game comes out more. It's cheap, fast, reliable. They do comfort trade, 100% legit, straight to your account for the cheapest price on the whole internet. Guys, I have started a free Discord. The link is down below in the description. Please do click and join the Discord. There'll be lots of different trading tips, stuff like that, in the actual um, Discord itself. But also, guys, I have started a Patreon. You can feel free to join at any level you like. See how it is. Um, you can make lots of different coins. I'll give extra tips, basically, you know, up to the gold tier where I will trade in your account for you and make you lots of coins. I'll be expecting you guys to make probably 1 million, 2 million per week with this. So, obviously, it's a very good value thing. So, yeah, I hope you do enjoy, guys, and I will see you all very soon in the video. Hey guys, welcome back to our brand new video guys. Today I'm going to be showing you how to trade with the icons. This has been massively requested over the last few days by people in my Patreon. If you aren't yet in my Patreon or my Discord guys, go and check it out. Um, obviously there's a link up to both down below. There is a free service which you can join with lots of different tips and etc. So come and join that if you don't want to pay for anything. It's totally free or there is an option where you can pay for other stuff. Like I do trade in your account and stuff like that. We're going to get started here now. You want to put an icon first of all, pretty obviously. I'm going to show you two ways you can do this to make lots of coins. I'm searching for the leagues, which is a great start. You want to put an icon and then you want to find the cheapest first of all. This is the easiest way to do it, but this is also the most competitioned way. So there's 145k in the cheapest. You want to then set it like one, let's say realistically 7k. Let's go 136 because in worst case you get an Inzaghi, which is worth obviously 136k. You want to just sit here and search like this. I'll try and move the control so it's not in the way. I noticed in the last video you could hear the controller the whole way through. You probably can again. But guys, thanks for all the love on the recent videos. We've had some really good views recently, which is really good and motivating. But you can first of all do it like this, or you can do it with the thing in 146. And just sit here and refresh back out like this. And obviously deals will pop up. It will get you um, banned a bit slower. But obviously it might make you a little bit slower to snipe it, which is probably why you don't get banned so quick. But this is the first method. The second one is my favourite way to do it. You want to put in here icon and you want to put in about 120k and just check it a second. So you can see we can go higher in that because there's more players in here. So let's go 141 and see if this is safe. It still is fine. I think that's actually a deal. No, it's not. I'm used to XRPS prices, so um, that is like about a 175 sell on PS. So here now, at this price, you'll see this is too far because there's two players over the hour. You can only have one. So you're going to drop this back down to about 145k, and this should be fine now. You'll see here, yeah, it's perfect. So you want to just sit here now on the X and B back out, or square and circle if you're on PlayStation, and just sit here like this, repeatedly doing it. Obviously, I've only got 150k, which is a nightmare, really, but I need to get trading. You can see my transfer this. I've got about 50 items in it. I have been selling stuff. I don't really trade on Xbox too much, and I don't have a PS5 yet, so that's what the videos are on Xbox at the moment. I hope that's okay. Um, but any advice for either console and farming, because I do trade on both, like you say. But you can see here, this is the problem with these. You don't want to buy these ones, obviously. These are like 100k. You're just looking for people to basically, the, the method is, guys, basically, if you're looking for people that are listing the cards up fast, because they're obviously not borrowing to put a bid in, so I'm just whacking a buy now up, and they might list it by mistake for a wrong price. That's regularly what happens. There's an awful lot of deals on this filter, like, obviously, there's a lot of competition, of course, because, let's be real, on the console, it's not the only method you can do. And obviously, on the web, you can cheat and stuff with bots and all that rubbish, but, I mean, I wouldn't go into that stuff. I'd just stay like this. It's much easier, um, and obviously a lot safer. You just keep searching. Obviously, it's unlikely we'll see something just sold. I don't know what that was. Or obviously, the bid went over the price that I put in. But you're just going to keep searching like this over and over again. It's a rare currency come up. You've got to learn them, basically, and get to grips with it. Or if you're on Xbox, this is another great method you can do. And it's putting in, like, 300k. And just scroll into the 59th. There's not many pages at all. And you can just check. We've got on the 59th minute. Any deals there? Check this Fieri. Obviously, it's not a good deal. But, um, loud up, let's check. 200. Not a good deal. You can keep putting this up. So, if you can get a page, if you can be bothered to search, like, a few extra pages. Like, if you look here, 500k now. It's getting a bit harder. There's a lot more pages. But, we're going to here now. And we'll go to that at 59th. And, we'll just check some of these. Like, more. 200k. Not a deal. Raquel Me 215. Not a deal. In Zog, you got to learn the prices, that's the thing, you've got to learn them, because it's not going to be sat here searching through them like crazy, and you're not going to get any deals, you're not going to be fast enough. So you want, ideally, this is how quick you want to do it, you want to get onto the 59th now like this, so you want to search in, go to the 59th really fast, then get there, find the 59th really quick, check the players that you want to check, obviously, all if you know the prices already, you don't have to check them at all, and then just go quickly back out and do the same thing again, repeatedly, over and over again. 
because there's a lot of deals that come up in the 59th here. You've got to be fast here. This is the problem. You've got to learn the prices, guys. You can't just come on this once and then like think you know everything because you're going to struggle, basically. But obviously, I don't know the PS prices and um, the Xbox prices at all. So me doing this is like a GG. I'd have no clue. I'd have to just check and hope for the best, which is dodgy. Like You don't want to do that at all. I only really know PlayStation prices. Um, I've obviously took time to learn them because that's my console that I trade on. So you want to take time to learn the console that you trade on, pretty much. So if you're on PlayStation, PlayStation or obviously Xbox or even PC. PC again, I don't know what the market is like on PC. I know nothing about PC, but obviously I can t I can give you advice from the console trading and try and help you guys along the way. There is one final move you can put in, and it is a bit of a trek. It's a million. You can just put it in here, but it is a trek. Like I say, you're probably about 40 pages in something like that. It's even worse during. It's only 9 a.m. right now, 10 a.m. But it's even worse at six. So if you've got a dedication to sit here and slave through. To about the 50th page obviously it can be worth it but that can happen right there which is a perfect time to end the video because let's be realistic we won't get in there and i've got no coins to do it but if that's what you want to do is get to the 59th minute you want to go slower than i did though and then obviously this will happen guys sometimes if you've probably never had this if you haven't sniped before all you need to do is just turn them upside down you get three of them the first time and then you do it wrong like me and i'm so stupid because now i've got to do them all again so that's having me do it wrong that was obviously deliberate um of course I promise that I was fully deliberate with just showing you guys what could happen if you did it wrong. But no, there you go. So you want to put them all around and then there you go, it's done. Only two stars there, which is crap. But yeah guys, thanks for watching the video. If you have enjoyed, please do drop a like. The video will be out on Thursday. I'm going to have daily videos out. However guys, I'm going to be a bit quiet really because I've got, I'm going to my mum's at the weekend and I won't really be on much. But there will be a video out every day scheduled. So please show them some love. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you all very